arbitration debate reached a new level immediately after President Trump signed an executive order targeting sanctuary cities or communities that have policies that protect undocumented immigrants. We do not have a problem. There is no problem that needs to be solved here. This is posturing. The issue became even more personal for Rob Davis, the mayor of Davis. He says his community became a sanctuary city decades ago to serve as a safe place for Central American refugees who fled violence in their countries. Meanwhile, Davis and other sanctuary cities are now caught in a different political battle. President Trump here is basically saying uh, you have to cooperate with ICE. Uh, you, you have to share information as is required by federal law. And if you don't, you may lose your federal funding. And that could amount to billions of dollars. Republican Senator Ted Gaines says he supports this latest White House decision. We want to provide safety uh, to Californians and to Americans and uh, for individuals that are have broken the law that are criminals in terms of uh, putting people at risk. This UC Davis student says our leadership is sending out the wrong message on immigration reform. It's more disappointing than anything to kind of see how things are going to change and how the next four years will be. Mayor Davis says the existing system works in his community. If someone commits a criminal act, we'll arrest them, but not on the basis of their documented or undocumented status. But others say there should be more oversight. That's fine until somebody murders somebody, then what are they going to say?